Poor Chuck. The hell? We're in Macon, or wherever Macon. Must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters. Look at all this food here. Wonder if someone's living down here. Probably. Look at all this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. We're in that place. We're in that community. I know it. They're gonna be like, holy god. Hi. How are you? Who are you? It's alright. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here... Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Look, I don't want to do this. Let's talk, okay? What's to talk about? You won't even tell us who you are. I have a little Lee. girl. I'm a history professor. And I don't want to die today. And I don't think you want to kill me either. Don't. Don't what come any closer. Or I'll shoot. Come on. Let's just talk about this. Vernon, what are you doing? Shoot him! Nobody needs to get shot. Just take it easy. I told you he's lying. He is one of them. Kill him before he kills us. Oh, god damn it. Thanks a lot, Vernon, you ass. Freeze. Who are you? It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why... You'd do well to turn around and leave, right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here... Are you from Crawford? I don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him Shut leave. Shut up. What do you want Shut me to do? Up. Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. No, it's you will. Right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. You're really not from Crawford? No, I'm really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? 
Yeah. Yep. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? Sewers. A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. I want to go home. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? God, I hate you. Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Yeah. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Don't Let's worry. Go. Don't worry, Scruffy Pete. He's dead. He's dead. He's dying. He's dead. Old guy's dead. Sorry, old guy. You're dead. Immediately dead. Your head's gonna explode. Soon as you step out of this room, your head's gonna blow up. Okay, goodbye. I'm going to die. Farewell. Oh, no, you're gonna die, too. Yeah, you're all gonna die. Okay, enjoy your deaths. I'm Doc Mitchell. <laughs> Hey, found an old guy. Clementine? Can old people. Clem? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's Thanks. this? He didn't tell you about me? I'm the one who saved his ass back at the river. Who's the fossil? What were you doing? Just looking. Figured you might have something you want to donate as a thank you for getting your friends back safely. Nope. I can give you my t your tool. I think you have something that belongs to me. Yep. Here you go. Thank you. I killed some people with it. Real people. Real life people. Are dead. Lee, thank God you're back. Crystal Found an old Patrol. guy. It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? this doctor Man. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Hug him. Could you Give take him a big hug. Him? Big kiss. Big kiss. Give him a big hug kiss. You have to help us. Please. I'm just an old I'll man. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Gonna have to chop his legs off and his arms. Sorry. Oh, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. So me dead. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Omid looks dead, and I don't want Professor Old Guy getting bit as immediately. He's dead. Clementine. He's dead. I, he's dead. He's dead. Clementine. Clementine. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Why don't we just ask Molly? Clem Strollers. <laughs> Where is she? Oh, it's me. I buried her in that drawing. That's that's so <laughs> Clem, you in here? Clementine? Look at me coming towards the camera. I'm coming towards the camera. Oh, there's nothing over there. It's a window. Clementine, you here? Camera. She might be in the attic. Hello? 
<laughs> what are you doing? Oh, uh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. You know where Clementine is? Where's Clementine? Don't Thank ask you. me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, oh. do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Okay. Maybe. First, I'm gonna look around, too. I don't care I can do about that. I just wanna find Clementine. But don't you wanna look at boxes and drawers and stuff? I know I do. Hello? Oh, shit. Whatever. I don't care. Clem? There's music. Clementine? You know, there's a lot of music, so I should go downstairs before some serious music comes Clementine! On. Come out! Please! She's probably literally right there. Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. First good thing that's happened since... What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? Hey man, I tried, but he gave me a look like he was gonna rip my face off. He won't listen to you. You think he was gonna listen to me? I guess. To hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Have either of you seen Clementine? Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, I gave you one job when I left here. Take care of Clementine. Then she shows up out on River Street looking for me. What the hell happened? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kinda crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? It's okay. I'm not mad at you. I just want to know where she is. I think she went out to play in the backyard? On her own? With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She Hundreds. She your ass. I'm gonna be banging it like a rock. Which is not very comfortable, to be honest. Clementine? Clementine! I'm a zombie now. Hey, look at me. I eat people. Yeah. Doors covered in vines. Don't think anyone came in through there. Unless they put the vines up after. She's out there making a garbage, a garbage fortress. That'd be awesome. That'd be the best. Hey! Get out of the doghouse. Dog. <laughs> I didn't even finish. I just gave up. I was like, yeah, whatever. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, that's right, because Professor Creepy Pants came by. She's playing hide and seek, ain't she? I'm a finder. Climb and turn in the bushes. Jump out and scare the hell out of me. Oh, okay. Where the hell is she? Covered in vines. Just oh, I think anyone God. came in through there. Ask if anyone's in there, it's obviously moving. 
She probably got in through the trap door. She's a little baby dog. Ow, my dick. You hit me in the balls. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Come what look, you doing? Look what I found. Chilling at the Holiday Inn? My god. A, a jet fighter. Jet fighter food maker. Sweet Jesus. Oh, wow. Whoa. I know, right? <laughs> How'd you get in there? Hey, found a boat. Mmm. Boat. And he craps himself, oozes down his leg. Disgusting. We gotta make it. You got. <laughs> Meanwhile, inside, time has stopped. Except for the old man. I'm sorry, I killed him. Bye. My sewer people need me. Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Pooped fever. all over. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you pacing. even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Hey guys, I'm still drunk. Well, I'm so drunk. You want the good news or the bad news? Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. Big so deal. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Find it. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Oh, no, Maybe I don't want to. should try there. I'm not going there. Are you drunk? Now, hold on a minute. Surely we have to try. If there are no. people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? I didn't Trust mean to go you there. You don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how gonna... exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Oh Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. My god. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's One of us will have to die. Not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. One what do you want die. in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? Come on, Ben. Do it. Come on, Ben. Do it. You're in. You Come go on. Tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. You're That's how I'm still alive. I'm gonna get bit and come back and not tell you and then bite you while we're going and then it'll... How long have you been there? 
Is it going to be dangerous? Is what Hell gonna be yeah. dangerous? Crawford. Welcome to Earth. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. I don't want anyone else to die. Too bad. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? <laughs> you said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? I highly doubt that. Clementine, I think it'd be safer for you to stay here with Omi. But what if something happens to him while you're gone? What do you mean? Kill him! He's sick. If he doesn't get better and, you know, he might try to hurt me. Can't I come with you? Hmm. Uh. God damn it. Uh. Okay. Fine. You can come. But you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay. I'm gonna go get ready. I'm gonna find your parents. I'm gonna be like, yo, we got your kid. And then run away. Your parents gonna go freak out style. It's gonna be awesome.